Multiple Jacksonville Sheriff's officers just left Hogan Road and surrounded the Park Place apartments for a reported burglary. Atia Collins was there on the scene. She's on your side with more details. Atia. Yes, when I arrived here on scene, I observed multiple officers. They had their weapons drawn and they were actually crouching behind a police unit. I then saw that group of officers move towards the apartment building and then I heard multiple loud bangs. Now, since that's happened, we have been able to get closer to the building and we can now see that this apartment here on the first floor has the windows blown out. And just in the last minutes, we've seen multiple detectives going in and out of that apartment, taking pictures. Here's what we know so far about what happened. A supervisor on scene tells me that officers were responding to a burglary and were clearing the apartment looking for a potential suspect. I overheard a different officer tell a group of bystanders who were standing on the street that the suspect was not found. Now the supervisor told me that they do have a person of interest, but when I asked if that person was removed from the apartments, he said that that was still under investigation. JSO officials also tell me that at one point there were nearly 10 officers here on scene responding to this reported burglary. Right now, officers are still going in and out of that first floor apartment. I've seen them taking some pictures. We've seen the crime scene unit pull up here and they're still investigating what exactly happened here and what led up to that call of a reported burglary. We will keep you updated as more details come into our newsroom. Reporting in Jacksonville, Tia Collins, First Coast News on your side.